Okay, this, ver this video is uh, about versioning. Uh, now, it's not really important and it's kind of an advanced topic. I was not sure whether making this video at the beginning of the course or putting it at the end. Um, because when you when we did this, look at the here, version 0.224. Okay, version 0.224. If we come to N8N, N8N NPM, okay, this is the official library, the, the repository where it is. Look at this. Zero, this is the NP. In case you don't know, uh, I'm not going to explain because this our program is about the Node.js, but it's the official repository where the, all the Node packages and are stored. And N8N currently it's in 0 0.224.4. The most important numbers are the ones in the left. This is major version, minor version, and uh, no, and uh, minor release. Okay, so we are in zero point. We, we are exactly in in this one. For the time that you watch this tutorial, could be that the number has changed. Okay, and if if the difference is only in the number on the right, should be okay. If there is only one or two uh, numbers different should be still okay but if the difference is huge like for example version 3.5 because two or three years have passed then it's when things can uh, begin to break down okay they can begin to break down because of the the version uh, versioning problems so if you go down here you will see that they say they recommend you to use docker docker is a technology very advisable but i didn't use docker because it implies to install another program to explain what is Docker, and I'm not going to do it. If you know what Docker is, perfect. The best way to use NHN is by using the, a Docker the, the, the way they specify here. If you don't know what Docker is, don't worry. Don't worry because we'll do it alter alternatively. And, um, and uh, the key point here is that uh, they specify here note the minimum required version for node it's 14.15 okay or above we are lucky because our node version it's 18 so 18 is above 14 so no problem but i'll show you now what would happen if we have a node version that it's not compatible with the n8n release and um, here in the look at this in this uh, page remember npmjs.com slash package slash na10 in this url there is a option called versions if you click here you would see all the different versions and when they were released 0 0.22 0. Point, okay so imagine that for some strange reason you are working in a company that is using this version so you should click here, right? You should click here and hopefully, hopefully they, they will say which node version this is compatible with. You see, now we are in the version 0 0.1. Look at this. Now I went to that specific version in time. So imagine that you are in a company and they're using this version. It's not, and you ask, please, could we update this version? No, because blah, 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 blah. It's not possible. Uh, stick to our, our way. Okay, okay, sorry. What should you do? The first thing you should do is come here to the node and look which is the version, the node version that you can use. Still, we are the same, but I will go now again to the to versions and I will go to the first one, 0 0.01. Let's see which node version it was required. It was four years ago. Okay, they didn't even have any explanation. <laughs> I went way too far. Let's try this one. They don't even have any uh, proper documentation. Jesus Christ. Okay, I'll go to this one maybe. Okay. Uh, they don't even explain. Okay, here documentation page no this is not because i want to go to the documentation page of that specific version 
Probably I'm going way too far in time. I'll try maybe this one. Five years, a year ago. Mm. I'm trying to find... Well, they, they were not very specific at that time with the... With the perhaps it was a small project, I guess. And they weren't really really worrying about the node versioning and um yeah it's not being very cl clarifying the their let's see use node yes okay the first the first time they specified it was over 14. Well, it doesn't matter because I will show you what the problem. And uh, I've been in this problem in this, uh, I've encountered this problem before. And fortunately, you get a terminal error saying something like node version not compatible. And believe me, I swear some that somebody had explained me what I will explain you now because all of this, this tutorial is very good. You will see it's, re it's a really good tool, but let's be honest. When you are alone with your computer, we all know what happens. That suddenly you're watching the tutorial and everything works fine. But then for you, oh shit, there is an error and it's not working as expected. So I've been there. I know what it is. I know how it feels. I know how much time you can lose trying to fix the error. So um, this video, it's, uh, I hope somebody had explained me this when I was learning, you know, I hope. Because the versioning, many times, very often, the problem is related with versions. Okay, so let's now get fluent okay, uh, with this concept of versions. And I will introduce you, well, I'll do it for the next video. I'll do it for the next video because it's kind of important topic.